Roman Reigns has made a surprising decision just days after he lost to Cody Rhodes at WrestleMania 40. So in today's video, we will explain exactly what is going on with Roman Reigns and give you all of the updates concerning Roman Reigns now that he no longer is champion and he has basically vanished from WWE. What exactly is going on? And what some are saying is a very sad sign of the times as a new video was released from WWE showing Roman's title that Cody won undergoing some changes. Roman's side plates were removed and in their place, the side plates for Cody Rhodes. And for Cody Rhodes and his fans, this was not sad at all. Instead, seeing this made them very happy. But Roman Reigns has to be deeply disturbed at what was taking place in this video. His side plates being discarded, making way for Cody Rhodes. Roman said the following, I apologize to my family, friends, and fans for my mistake in violating WWE's wellness policy. No excuses, I own it. And that was posted by Roman Reigns on June 21st, 2016. This was an unearthed tweet that many fans forgot about. It was posted eight years ago. And many say that if you take out the part about violating WWE's wellness policy, this could have been a new tweet from Roman about losing to Cody, talking about how he apologizes to his family, friends, and fans for his mistake, mistake in losing to Cody. No excuses, I own it. Now Roman tweeted this out back in 2016 because he was taking prescription medication that he did not tell WWE about and that could be seen as performance enhancing prescriptions. Cody Rhodes is being positioned to be the new face of WWE. Some say this was a needed change and it will make the company even more popular. Others say that this was the wrong decision and it will cause WWE to lose popularity, especially if Roman Reigns isn't around. So what about that? Will Roman Reigns be around in the coming days, weeks, and months? Well, Roman Reigns has just made a decision that will truly change everything. Let's get into that right now. Some fans of Roman Reigns are disgusted at WWE trying to cash in on Roman losing. On the WWE shop, there are many new items celebrating Cody Rhodes' historic win at WrestleMania 40. Some might look at this merchandise and say, of course, WWE is there to make money, and they want to make money off their champion. But others say this move is disrespectful to Roman Reigns, because where's his merchandise? Costing hundreds of dollars, celebrating his nearly four-year title reign. Instead, they basically pushed Roman's merchandise off of the WWE shop. In its place are autographed plaques of Cody Rhodes holding the title that Roman Reigns held just days ago. And they're selling for $100, $200, $300. dollars they are even selling an autographed Cody Rhodes undisputed WWE Universal title for $699. But the question is, will this Cody merchandise outsell Roman Reigns' merchandise? Well, WWE is betting on it. They believe that Cody Rhodes will become an even bigger star than Roman Reigns, and some in the company believe that he's already surpassed Roman Reigns in terms of star power and worldwide notoriety. This is just another sign that WWE has moved on from Roman, but yet another sign that WWE is doing their best to move on from Roman is a post on Instagram from Triple H. Here we see the poster for the next WWE pay-per-view backlash, which will take place in France. 
on May 4th. Here we see Cody Rhodes with the title that he won from Roman Reigns over his shoulder. Along with this poster, Triple H says the following, a new era for a new champion. And next month, the WWE Universe in France helps usher it in. So right there, that buzzword, this is a new era. New champion, new era. Roman, he's old era. He's Vince era. This, Cody Rhodes, he is the new era. He is Triple H's era. And obviously, they are positioning Cody to be the face of Triple H's era in WWE. But this isn't the only poster creating controversy in terms of Roman Reigns. There are obviously lots of questions right now about is Roman Reigns still under contract with WWE? Has he retired? Has he left? Has he quit? Has he been fired? And the reason why there are questions is nobody is saying anything. We've gotten a few bits of information here and there, but nothing concrete about what the heck is going on with Roman Reigns. Well, now Roman Reigns has made a decision, and some fans might be angry about this decision. Others might be happy. WWE unveiled a poster for SummerSlam this week, and there is one person, one major star, missing from this poster, and his name is Roman Reigns. Now, SummerSlam is probably the third biggest pay-per-view of the year for WWE. First, you have WrestleMania, then you have Royal Rumble, and then SummerSlam. So, SummerSlam, it's all hands on deck. It's every big star will show up, have a match, be on the card, try to sell as many tickets as you can with big-time matches and big-time stars, but yet there's one person missing, Roman Reigns. Instead, you have Cody Rhodes front and center, the face of the Triple H era in WWE, Logan Paul, Rhea Ripley, The Miz, Jade Cargill, and Bianca Belair. No Roman. Why? Some fans are speculating and saying it's because Roman has made a decision to either retire from WWE, take the rest of 2024 off to be with his family, or you have the other side that maybe Roman made a decision that he will return at SummerSlam, but he wants it to be a surprise. SummerSlam takes place August 3rd, so that means if Roman really is going to be gone until then, it will be a four-month hiatus. But we heard that he might return on the SmackDown the day before SummerSlam, but if that's the case, that means he's back in WWE before SummerSlam. Why isn't he on the poster? And it could be because Roman has made his decision and he has decided to say goodbye to WWE. What are your thoughts about Roman Reigns being left off the official poster for SummerSlam 2024? Leave a comment and give me your opinion.